here we're going to take a look at our new Mighty Minnow. It's just under two inches long, about 1.8, 1.9 inches long. And it's kind of a hybrid style little bait. It has a little paddle tail to, there at the back, so it will swim, just like a little swim bait. But also it has a little bit of a forked tail back there too. So you can use it uh, just as a regular little bait under a float to jig it and get that tail to flick and twitch. Same with the little dorsal fin there, another small little detail there that gives it a little bit extra movement. The real neat thing about this bait is kind of the little cutout scallop portions of this tail, which just gives this bait a lot of action for being so small. If that tail was solid, it wouldn't have near the action that it does uh, with all those little scalloped edges. But on the head, there's plenty of plastic there for you to uh, rig your little your little jig on. And for this bait, really a size four hook is about the right size. Size four will go kind of all the way back to the meat of that head. You could get away with a six if you wanted to. Um, even a two, it might reach back into that dorsal fin there a little bit. But uh, size four, if you wanted to hit it just perfect, that would probably be the size that I would choose uh, to fish this on. And you could fish it a lot of different ways. Like I said, you could fish it like a regular swim bait, just like this on a little jig head. Just throw it out, reel it back, and that uh, little tail will kick and flick. Um, but you can hang it under a float too, and just twitch it under the float, and just let that little fork tail um, kind of dance around. Uh, but there's also other things you can do with this bait. We have this little micro spy jig with a little prop on the front. That's a good little rig to use. And just remember with these spy jigs, especially in these smaller sizes, this is a size four, you don't need to work this bait fast. This little propeller will buzz um, on a slow retrieve. So don't overwork this bait too much. Fish it slow and also let it fall too. This propeller will uh, spin on the fall. So definitely work it slow. Another thing you can do is fish it on a little micro underspin. This is also a, a size two. And this is the chameleon color. This is a color shifting color. It kind of shifts from brown to kind of this pinkish purple color. Um, really neat, neat new color for us. And we have a few different versions of micro underspins on our website. The other thing you can do is just use it as a trailer. This is the micro spin jig, also on a size four. This is a 1 16th ounce. And uh, you could just use it as a little trailer and also a micro swim jig too. This is also 1 16th ounce on a four and you can just throw it out there, reel it back, let the paddle tail do the work. Um, you can also fish these swim jigs under a float. Um, you can fish it under a slip float, a fixed float, either way. Um, you just twitch it, let it dance kind of in the waves and uh, yeah, a lot of different things you can do with this this little guy, but really cool kind of modern style hybrid look to it. So that one is called the Mighty Minnow, and you can use it uh, for just about anything that eats a little minnow. Um, panfish, creek bass, trout, perch, uh, you name it, this little guy will catch them if the fish are keyed in on little minnows. And you can find them on our website, moondogbaitco.com.